In 1933, Lady Evelyn Cobbold was the first British Muslim woman to make the pilgrimage to Mecca and perform Hajj. She had to seek special exemption from Saudi Arabia's minister in London, who requested formal permission to allow her to perform Hajj. Born in 1867 to an Anglo-Scottish aristocratic family, the daughter of the seventh Earl of Dunmore, Lady Evelyn spent her childhood winters between Algiers and Cairo. She used to escape her family's Moorish villa to spend time with her Algerian friends visiting mosques. She learned to speak Arabic and said that it was during that time in her childhood where she felt she was a little Muslim at heart. She announced her conversion to Islam in front of the Pope. When His Holiness suddenly addressed me, asking if I was a Catholic, I replied that I was a Muslim. What possessed me, I don't pretend to know. A match was lit, and I then and there was determined to read up and study the faith. She wrote the book called Pilgrimage to Mecca, where she described her journey to Hajj. We walk on the Holy of Holies, the house of Allah, rising in simple majesty. It would require a master pen to describe the scene. Lady Evelyn died in 1963 and was buried, as she instructed, on a remote hillside on her Glen Karen estate in Westeros. She asked that the verse, Allah is the light of the heavens and the earth, be written on her gravestone.